All right, standing here in the chaos of the media room here, Mayweather Pacquiao with Terrence Crawford. Uh, first of all, Terrence, what do you think about this uh, the scene here? Oh man, it's it's crazy out here. You know, a lot of people coming to see this fight. Now this here is the biggest fight in years, if ever. Is this something that boxing is going to be able to build on, or is this a you know one-off kind of a you know because of the special nature of this fight? Well, we just have to see. You know, nobody can tell what tomorrow brings because it could be the biggest thing that happened to boxing and give us that big boost, but it could be this one big fight and then you know a whole bunch of dull moments in boxing. So who knows? As far as the, the hype in this fight is crazy, the way it's just happened, I mean, absolute chaos in there. Is there any chance at all that this fight, no matter what happens, can live up to the hype that's going on here? Of course. Of course. If both fighters go in there and do what they, you know, got to do to put on a great performance and a great show for everybody, then it's going to live up to the hype. But if, you know, it's one-sided, then, you know, everybody going to be disappointed. How do you see the fight playing out? Is it kind of, you know, the puncher Manny against the, the slick, Floyd and whoever imposes, you know, their, their game plan is going to be the one walking out, or how do you see it playing out? Well, we can't call Manny the puncher no more yeah, because right. he ain't had a knockout in some right. time now, so uh, we'll just have to see. Now, I know I, I, someone asked you earlier, and I, I kind of the same thing. Uh, these guys entering the twilight of their careers are the two unquestionable huge stars. You're an up-and-coming guy. Well, I won't say up-and-coming. You're here. You're a title holder, but uh, you know you're one that a lot of people point to as the potential next superstar. Is that something that you think that you can live up to? Of course, you know. But for the time being, I just got to work on my craft and continue to get better. And, and then just finally, with this as crazy it is out here, you're a Midwest guy. You know, you're not usually around this kind of stuff where you're at. Is this something that you would be able to embrace as you know as your time comes to be on the top like this? Or, or is this something that you'd rather just kind of avoid and, and just deal with things in the ring? Well, you know me, you know, uh, I just do what I'm supposed to do. You know, box, and if this comes with boxing there, I guess I gotta get used to it. But as far as, you know, everything else, I just roll with the punches. And how does this fight play out? I'm leaning towards Mayweather. I feel he's the superior boxer. I feel he's the smarter boxer. And he's going to go in there and make his adjustments and put on a great show. But if Manny come to fight and can get Mayweather to fight his fight, then Manny got a good, uh, a good way of winning. Now you just fought recently, but when do we see you back in the ring? I don't know yet. You know, I'm just enjoying my vacation. And, you know, whenever they call me, I'm ready. I'll stay in the gym. So this is a vacation for you? It's a vacation. <laughs> All right, man. Enjoy the fight. Appreciate it. Thanks.